Hi everybody, today I will show you how to using the new program HP Pro Book Elite Book Package Creator OC. So open core now is the bootloader, the official bootloader for the HP Pro Book Elite Book Package Creator. So uh, you have to follow every step uh, correctly on that page guys because uh, it's very important to follow every step. The video is here. All the details on the image is here. You have to download the program here. Just download on your download folder. The support laptop for the set series now, the 6 series is gone from the program because the 6 series not working on macOS Big Sur. 11 the latest mac os from apple so now you only the 7 series laptop so guys follow every instruction here and the video to continue uh, to using the program you need the 16 gig usb drive you need the zip security the system integration security disabled on your mac you need the gatekeeper disabled so when you have uh, download the program just put the folder on your desktop and you have the zip security i repeat again the zip security for the creation of the usb this is the first part of the video and i will show you the second part on the pos installation so now you have to disable the gatekeeper on your system first just run this simple command and now you have to run this command for open the package creator all the things is on the dmg image if guys you know you, you don't know uh, how to using the program every file is on the dmg image for the protection of the file and the script and all things uh, the cats everything is protect on the dmg image so i just show you this now you have to run you run in the the command so you have two option option a is uh, the creation of the package for the post installation and uh, I'm using the PKG build command you will see and the product build for the final uh, package so the package is created on my desktop you will see here so I will put the pass installer here. Now you have to type any key to return. And I will build now the, the USB installer. So you have to type B for the creation of uh, install media HP laptop OC.app. .app. So type any key and type X for exit this is the usb installer and this is the folder for the creation of the final package so you can put it on the trash now i'm using a 16 gig usb drive for the video demonstration so you have to run the program and follow every instruction of the the program so you have to select the create install media now i will erase the drive so you click here on the partition of your usb you select unmount the drive first and you select the entire disk here and click erase on the grid partition map and the mac os extend journal system file rename the drive the name of you want and 
you select erase the USB installer. It's very important to erase on the good format for the creation of the USB. So you have to exit the disk utility to continue. Select the USB and type your password. You have five macOS. This is the pop-up security. You always select OK on the macOS Catanilla and Mojave because you have the pop-up security. Now you, you you can create the USB for macOS uh, Sierra 10.12 or you can create the USB at 10.13 to macOS Big Sur 11. So this is my choice because I I have to uh, I, I have created today uh, the macOS Big Sur installer and I show you every step on the video and I will show you the second video for the post installation to the SSD. So my choice is uh, Big Sur from uh, OK. I will continue here and now I have select my installer. You see, you can select uh, Catalina, iSierra, Mojave not Sierra because Sierra is uh, the other option so I will select install macOS Big Sur this is my choice I choose and now the USB creation is on the road now guys so you have to wait on the 15-25 minutes because it's very uh, big installer it's a 9 gig the macOS Big Sur 11 so it's a standard USB drive. It's a 15 at 20, 25 minutes. Depend the speed of your USB and depends the speeds of your system. So I will back just at the end of the video to show you the next step and the installer uh, open core. USB is almost complete. Now the, the open car installer is open. So you have to select continue and you will see here no DSDT on the USB installer because it's not work for the pass installation. So don't put the DSDT on the, the FE partition. I will show you here you change the destination and you select install macOS Big Sur Beta continue install on that see the AFI partition that's it guys so can close this this is the FE partition here the open car the driver the kex for the USB installation and the ACPE you will see no DSDT AML on that program because it will not work so this is the file I'm using for the USB creation. The bootable drive is perfect now. So this is the installer USB. Now you have to copy the pass installer. You have to copy the gatekeeper for disabling the gatekeeper. And you just install macOS with the USB installer. Now I will show you uh, just a little bit the, the POS installer just to show you the option uh, fast now because I will show you on the second video. You see here all the option for the 7 series laptop. So you have to select one of them of your laptop. You have to select the Intel HD 4000 uh, the low graphic or if you have the ice cream you select the ice cream 
the HDMI the same if you have the low screen and the high screen HDMI anyway I will show you with the next video for the post installation now you have all file for the post installation you have just boot with the F9 menu select the USB and your select the install macOS Big Sur Beta icon on the open core bootloader. So now I have to reboot and uh, plug the USB on my laptop HP ProBook 6570B with the installation of the macOS Big Sur. See you on the next video guys.